I think about dopamine as the currency of motivation. I think about is a young male or I or anyone investing your dopamine? What's dopamine? It's your motivation and mm. energy. Are you investing it or are you just spending it? Now you can get things that are surely for pleasure, right? I eat food. You could say, well, the food gives you energy to do other things. Okay, you get a nice painting that gives you more energy and pleasure because you you enjoy it. It's a it's some visual feedback on kind of that you've gotten to the point where you could buy that. That's an investment of your dopamine resources into money, money into into some thing, a painting. There's also just sheer spending of dopamine. Your time and your life energy, you're not going to reproduce as a consequence of being on OnlyFans. It's probably lowering your reproductive potential, either directly or figuratively. Yeah, and same thing with social media. You can glean incredible, valuable content. I do, you do, we, we, we teach on social media, we learn on social media, that then you can take into the real world. But years ago, I think it's an investor by the name of Chris Saka. He talked about you're either a consumer or a creator. In my own mind, expanded on that and and decided, well, when I go to a platform where I'm a consumer, like social media, I'm trying to glean things that allow me to be a better creator off platform and then bring those back to platform. Now think about all these people who are just consuming on social media, but it's not enriching their lives in any way. 